fellow soldier hopes someone comes forward after his friend was found dead in a Clarksville apartment over the weekend. Now, police still haven't said how she died, but they are investigating it as a homicide. This is Nikki McGee joined us now in studio with details. Nikki. Well, Katia Duenas Aguilar was just 23 years old. Her friend Ramia remembers going through basic training with her. She says Katia didn't deserve to die, and is asking for anyone with information to come forward. So far, police aren't saying how Katia died, just that this is a homicide. They also turned down our request for 911 calls from that evening. However, we do know that they are working with criminal investigators from Fort Campbell. Today, Ramia tells me that she loved Katia, who also loved her son above all else and had a passion for serving her country. It felt surreal. It still feels surreal because it's like she was such a, a great person. So for someone to do that, I don't I don't understand it. But yeah, I, I was very shocked. I was very <clears throat> saddened about it. And then, you know, my condolences to the family and, you know, her, her mom, her dad, like especially her son, you know, now he had to grow up without a mother. So. Now, Katia was found dead in the 900 block of Tiny Town Road Saturday night. Anyone with video of the area is asked to call police right away. You can also reach Crime Stoppers to stay anonymous. Bob.